this is Ron Garvick with News Channel 18. It sounds like there's a shortage of chips. I don't know what that really means, but the organizations throughout the automotive industry says there is a shortage of chips. Now we went to a local grocery store to see if they had any chips available. And I'm gonna take you to that scene right now. As you see, we're in this local grocery store and as you can see behind me, there's plenty of chips. So I don't know what the big deal is on missing chips anywhere. We have plenty of chips. We met up with some biker chips in California and they told us that there is 13 to 18 chips out on the highway catching criminals that are speeding, reckless driving, or they have DUIs. And this is what one officer had to say. Here in California, policemen called chips that ride on motorcycles have a big issue. They literally told us there's no chip issue around. As they ride their motorcycles through California, they have an idea that people just want to think that they do not exist for the chance of them being obsolete. I believe people think uh, there's no cops at all here in uh, California because they uh, they want to speed and take the advantage of uh, taking away from where they need to be uh, abiding by the law. And, you know, to be completely honest, I, I think this is a great opportunity to let them know that chips in California still exist. And I believe that if they don't believe us, we will pull them over and they will get a huge fine. Now, this fish and chip restaurant here in New Hampshire said they have plenty of fish and chips. As you notice that the fish and chips that are brought to you by uh, Ruffles, Doritos, and, you know, Lay's. It looks like those chip factories are still open. And as you notice, we went to Los Angeles and there was plenty of chip and dells there was plenty of chip and dells that they were open nightly and they were full of capacity when folks actually showed up to the event so it looks like la has plenty of chip and dells we also attended a cow chip throwing contest in beaver oklahoma it's the national cow chip throwing contest they hold they hold every year and as it looks like that the cow has plenty of chips also so in all reality are we really dealing with a shortage of chips or is the whole world just blind to see there's chips everywhere could this be a uh, presidential debate? In the next three years, should we be debating on plenty of chips? Or are we just blind to see that the chips are right in front of us, but we just tend not to see it? From News Channel 18, I am Ron Garber.